right, you're watching a live signal of our sister Chinese channel uh, with our uh, Chinese reporter giving live commentary about this uh, beautiful process. It's a spectacle by Mother Nature, and it happens every year. We're having simultaneous interpretation here on CCTV News of the great migration of Tibetan antelopes. This year, the numbers have increased by 50% thanks to conservation efforts. <laughs> 呃, 两年前, Two years ago, I followed the, uh, followed the group of experts. We filmed the birth giving process of antelope, and this time we had sophisticated high powered lens. We can clearly pick, capture this uh, birth process. Normally, it's a very special process. You can see it's a gathering of the antelope, and they will show some special symptoms when they give birth. They will go by themselves, and sometimes they will uh, dig in will dig dirt. And inside the camera, you can see. And when they are doing this, you can see that they are about to give birth. So they will choose a uh, low land area, and they want to use the strength of the land to help them give birth. And the female antelope will fall down. And uh, their first two legs will fall down first, and then the hind legs will kneel down. In Zhuolan Lake, it has a very um, complete um, wild species. They have a lot of other animals as well, such as well. And after giving birth, the female antelope was very fragile. And uh, sometimes the little baby may be eaten by the other predators, or by the other uh, natural enemies. So they need to uh, feed themselves. Sometimes they eat grass. After giving birth, the first thing they do is to, uh, is to use their tongue to lift their baby. And then they will let the wind to dry the hair of the little baby. Through our observation, we can see if the little baby is very fragile, and they can't stand up for a long time, they might be abandoned. So how to judge whether the baby is healthy or not? So first of all, they need to stand up by themselves. By relying on themselves. Second, they need to rely on themselves to walk out the first step in their life. And third, they need to um, feed themselves and um, having milk from the mother by themselves. 